in the middle and turned around and saw this guy. He had a hat just like this and he was playing the organ and I was like, that is really cool. I really want to do that because he's all the way up there and he has a hat on <laughs> and he looks cool and he's making some cool noises. So I came here one Sunday and my dad brought me. We were here at Mass and I just trickled up and I was a little kid sitting here on the bench just watching him play and um, started taking lessons with him and started coming into church at night and just practicing. I think the reason why I'm still here playing this organ is because it helps me with compositions. As a composer, I'm able to come up here and basically play as an orchestra. And that's why it's called the King of Instruments, because you have all of these parts and you can play all of these parts. So it really frees me up in terms of, you know, writing on a piano, which you just have that one sound, you know, hammer hitting string. With this, I'm able to create and visualize um, musically what it's going to sound like if I were to orchestrate it with brass, flutes, and strings. There are some Sundays I come in and play church music and some Sundays I just improv and play whatever I want to play. I don't think that uh, anyone's going to come up and say, hey man, that's not church music, stop it, it sounds ugly. Which, if it sounds ugly, then I probably won't play it. <laughs> I got. <laughs> <laughs>